How to change block strap settings after installing. Well, that's what I'm going to show you guys in this super quick and easy tutorial. So if this video has helped you out, please let me know in the comments or simply just leave a like so I actually know that this video has helped you out. Now over here, I have the block strap uh, application. And if, if I double click on this, it will pretty much just start Roblox. And um, let's just wait for this to load. But it pretty much just starts the regular Roblox and obviously you will have the mods and everything which we have installed. But um, yeah, this pretty much is it. So if you would like to change these settings after we have already installed this, what you want to do is simply uh, open up the start menu. Now, you should have, uh, there should have been added a block strap menu to your start page pretty much so here we have play block, block strap and also the block strap menu if you cannot find this simply just search for blocks strap and here we have the block strap menu as well as the play roblox version uh which we which i just opened pretty much but you want to open up the blocks strap menu once you've opened up the menu here is where we can now change everything we would like so here we can change the fast flags if we would like to uh, the mods like the death sound and everything and if you are happy with this once you have changed everything all you pretty much have to do is just click on save so here if you click on save it says settings have been saved so now these settings will apply the next time you will launch roblox so if you, for example, have Roblox opened, you change the settings, then it won't apply immediately. You first have to close Roblox, open it up again uh, like this, and then the new settings uh, have been applied. So that is pretty much it. That is how to change Blockstrap settings after installing.